Hi, I'm Dr. Mike Atkinson, and we're here today at Brookfield Zoo's Animal Hospital where our team is taking a look at Ben, one of our male orangutans. Ben's about 37 years old, so we've got a lot going on today. We're going to be doing just a general examination of him, checking blood work. Ben's also going to be having his teeth looked at and cleaned. One of the things that we're really taking a very close look at today with Ben is his cardiac health or his heart health. Our veterinary team is being joined today by Dr. Buscio, who's a veterinary cardiology specialist, and Dr. Buscio is doing a cardiac ultrasound examination of Ben's heart. This gives us a really fantastic look inside of his heart at the valves and the different structures inside to understand better how his heart is functioning so that we know what medications would be most appropriate in keeping Ben's heart as healthy as possible. We'll be coupling that with a CT scan today to also get a good look at Ben's heart as well as the other organs inside of his body to really thoroughly assess him from head to toe, inside and out. In Ben's case, he's fairly old for a male orangutan, and this is a problem that he may not have lived long enough in the wild to even develop. People tend to think of the wild as a pristine place, but in reality, animals in the wild face a large number of threats, as well as diseases, parasites, and a number of other conditions that can really impact their health. Our antans are critically endangered in their natural habitat, and we've seen populations decline by over 90% in the last century. One of the biggest risks facing orangutans is the loss of habitat and habitat destruction for the development of palm oil plantations. Palm oil can be found in anything from products we use at home in terms of our food, uh, margarine products, some of the candy that we eat at home, as well as cosmetics, detergents, and a variety of other sources. One of the things that you can actually do at home to help with orangutan conservation is to be sure to look for products that don't contain palm oil, or if they do, be sure to look for products that contain palm oil from sustainable sources. One of the things that we're able to do here with animals at Brookfield Zoo is to provide them with fantastic medical care. And you've seen everything that we're able to do today with Ben, as well as all of our other animals and the care that we provide every day. With that fantastic care, these animals are able to live very long lives. And with that comes the development of some of these age-related changes and, and disease processes that we see. Fortunately, we're able to get a very good assessment of Ben and uh, take reactive measures to be able to address those health concerns as they develop. It's just one example of the dedicated care that these animals receive from their animal care staff, as well as our team of veterinarians, nutritionists, and everyone else involved in keeping these animals healthy here at Brookfield Zoo.